next guest played drama queen Sharpay Evans in Disney's High School Musical franchise. She took home Best Breakthrough Performance for that role at the 2009 MTV Movie Awards. Now she's making us scream and laugh in Scary Movie 5. Take a look. Here comes Mommy and Aiden entering the house for the very first time. This is where we're going to protect you and make sure nothing bad happens. Oh my God, Aiden! I'm Maybe sorry. we should so put him in the carrier. There. See? Whew, that's better. Oh my gosh. Dad, I lost the baby! Huh? Oh my gosh, Aiden! Oh. Aiden, where are you? Oh, uh, Aiden! Where did you go? Here's your sister, Kathy. Honey, it's okay. It's okay. Babies always cry. All you gotta do is cheer them up a little. Yeah. I'm your silly mommy. There you go. You're a natural. <laughs> What's that smell? <laughs> ah! oh. from like stepmom and like away from your high school days now it's official I know <laughs> it's it's cool it's awesome I'm really excited it was a lot of fun you're all grown up I know <laughs> and, and I'm never gonna let you babysit ever <laughs> yeah it's so funny I have a three-year-old niece and she actually saw that I did a morning show and my mom and her were watching it and I didn't think she'd even understand it she was like as she burnt her baby <laughs> I was like oh no she's never gonna let me babysit her never no you're <laughs> yeah. scary I know. <laughs> Um, so yes, scary movies. These are all these are all like my favorite movies. I love these oh, movies. Cool. They're ridiculously funny, and they spoof like all the greatest movies of the year. Mm -hmm. So how many movies did we spoof this year? We spoofed a lot. It was like we had Black Swan, Paranormal Activity, Mama, Inception, Rise of the Apes, um, Evil Dead. It was yes. a lot. And, and you guys were actually able to get Evil Dead in, right? Right at the last minute? Is that yeah. when you guys were doing reshoots in February? Yeah, we did. Yeah, we spoofed off the trailer. So it's, it's pretty I mean, funny. You had to, right? It was going to be the biggest movie. Oh, yeah, exactly. You it's, guys went to see it last week, and now go see our movie this weekend. <laughs> so which one was the one that was the most fun to spoof? For me, it would have to be Black Swan, just because Molly Shannon was, um, she's in the, that segment of the movie, and there's this bathroom scene we did together, and I could not stop laughing. I think the only shot they got to be not laughing was the one that they put in the movie. <laughs> it was so funny. That's terrible. Yeah. Did you tell her to shut up? No, I mean, she didn't even say anything. <laughs> it's like, she's just walking past me, but it's like this, like, zoomed in shot on me. I'm supposed to look all serious and worried and concerned, and she's, like, making all this noise, like, and she's, like, got all this, like, braces on because she can't walk and she's just going into a bathroom stall and just her doing that all the physical comedy I just could see her in the corner of my eye and I could not stop laughing and it was like I didn't want to break character because it's Molly Shannon that I'm working with but I couldn't help myself I mean she's a superstar she's so funny <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she's amazing she's awesome um okay so what is what makes a better date movie the ones that make you scream or the ones that make you laugh I think the ones that make you laugh definitely because this will do both yeah it'll make you scream and laugh will it make you laugh more I think it'll make you laugh more will it make you pee your pants a little bit in, well, if yeah, if you're that type of person, yeah. <laughs> like incontinent, like, well, I guess, if you can't keep it in, I guess. All right, fair enough. Yeah. Then there's some also. You, I mean, you mentioned Molly Shannon, but there's some really great cameos in this. Can, yeah. Obviously, we got Charlie Sheen and Lindsay Lohan. Everybody's talking about them. Yeah. But we also got you in a scene with Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson was awesome. He was pretty intimidating, but he was awesome. What does that tattoo look like in person? It's, it reminds me of The Hangover, actually. <laughs> yeah, it definitely reminds me of The Hangover. But it's cool. He's a super nice guy, like really, really nice. Did you like ask him for any moves or anything? No, no. Jerry O'Connell, he kind of does like a move on Jerry, and he's like, I swear if he hits me one time, I'm going to be like, oh, my God. <laughs> he was definitely always nervous at that shot. I yeah. mean, even if Mike is kidding, he'll yeah, hit you. Yeah, he's like, you never know. <laughs> they're like, they're lethal <laughs> weapons. <laughs> now, everybody remembers last year was sort of taken over by something that you did. Call Me Maybe video. Oh, I was like, what? <laughs> Carly Rae Jensen put all of her besties in one video, and it, like, took over the world. Yeah. Do you feel do you, like you should be taking all of the credit or some of the credit <laughs> for the success of that song? No, it's year? a really good song. I mean, that's why we did it. It was just we were all sitting together, and we are like, you yeah, know, it's such a really good song. So, like, let's do something. And Did you ever think for one second that when you guys were doing that, that 
everyone, including the staff here at VH1, was going to be doing <laughs> their own version of the Call Me Maybe. No, I honestly, we did that over like several nights of hanging out. That's why we're like kind of dressed up in different things and usually when we were in the sepia colors because we have no makeup on. <laughs> we're just like <laughs> hanging out like in sweats. So it was just, we were doing it for fun and it just kind of like, it was crazy how everybody, you know, I had people coming up to me like, I love you in the Call Me Maybe video. <laughs> I was like, like, as if it's part of my credits now. <laughs> like, this is so weird. As it should be. And I also like to know that now in my Instagrams, I'm gonna put everything in the sepia when I'm not wearing makeup. This is really good yeah. tricks to know. Good trick. Thanks for that. All right, so since we have you here, we're gonna play a little game with you. This one's fun. Here's how it's gonna work. Since you've graduated from High School Musical to Scary, we want to learn a little more about you in a game we call the Wheels of Witch. Yeah! Well, and here they are. So basically, um, one wheel has like some silly, scary movie scenarios, and the other wheel has some horror high school situations. And we're gonna spin it, and you have to choose uh, between which, which one. one. Okay. Yeah. So grab that one. I'm gonna grab this one. Okay. Let's do a little spin. <clears throat> Boyfriend turns out to be a 500-year-old vampire or braces and headgear until day after graduation. Oh, oh I definitely go with boyfriend turns out to be 500-year-old vampire. <laughs> I mean, there's and a bonus like on that. Pattinson, you know? <laughs> Maybe. I mean, at the end of the day, no boyfriend, boyfriend. Yes, yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, let's spin again. Oh, We're gonna do that. Uh, all friends turn into brain-eating zombies, Ooh. or always pick last for kickball. Oh. I kind of love zombies, so I have to say all friends turn into brain. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> you are a girl after my own heart. I love this. Okay, keep going. If it lands on the same thing, really? Oh, man. Gypsy's curse makes you thinner, or wedgies at gym every day. Whoa. I think wedgies at gym. I don't. I can't get any thinner. So. <laughs> Yeah. I don't want to get it. <laughs>